I am Anil Kumar sharing with you one of the best questions on application of quadratic functions. The question here is, determine the equation of the line that passes through the points of intersection of the graph of quadratic function f of x equals to x square minus 4 and g of x equals to minus 3x square plus 2x plus 8. You can always pause the video, answer the question and look into my suggestions. To begin with, we have to find intersection of these two parabolas. So intersection really means a point where f of x is equal to g of x, right? So we can equate both these functions and solve for x. So we have x square minus 4 as f of x, which is equals to minus 3x square plus 2x plus 8. Bringing all terms to one side, we get x square plus 3x square minus 2x. We already have minus 4 here and then minus 8 equals to 0. x square plus 3x square is 4x square minus 2x minus 12 equals to 0. We can take 2 common, right? So we have 2x square minus x minus 6 equals to 0. To factor, we are looking for a product of 2 times minus 6, which is 12. So we are looking for a product of minus 12 and sum of minus 1, p plus q as minus 1. Numbers are minus 4 and 3, so we could write this as 2 times uh, 2x square minus 4x plus 3x minus 6 equals to 0. And now we can factor 2x from here. So we get x minus 2. We can factor 3 getting x minus 2 equals to 0. Perfect. So let's take this function to the right side and solve it further. So what we have here is 2 times, if I take x minus 2 common, I have left it 2x plus 3. So we have x minus 2 times 2x plus 3 equals to 0. Now that gives us two zeros. 1 is at x equals to 2 and the other one is at x equals to minus 3 over 2, correct? So these are the two zeros which we have got. Since we need to find equation of the line, we need to find the y values also. So let's find the value of the function at 2 and at minus 3 over 2. So for 2, let's use f of x. At 2 will be 2 square minus 4, which is 4 minus 4, which is 0. So one of the points is 2 and 0. The other one will be at minus 3 over 2, right? Minus 3 over 2. That gives us minus 3 over 2 whole square minus 4, which is 9 over 4 minus 4. So that gives us 9 minus 16 over 4. And that is minus 7 over 4, right? So the other point is uh, minus 3 over 2 minus 7 over 4, right? So now we have to find equation of the line through the two points of intersection. So let's find equation of line. We know the two points are 2 and 0 and the other one is minus 3 by 2 and the y value is minus 7 over 4, correct? To find equation of the line, let's find slope first, m, which is y2 minus y1. So minus 7 over 4 minus 0 divided by minus 3 over 2 minus 2. So that is minus 7 over 4. And here we have uh, times 1 over minus 3 over 2 minus 2. So we can multiply them by 2, right? So we get minus 7 over 
4 times minus 3 over 2 gives us minus 6 and 4 times minus 2 gives us minus 8 and so we get minus 7 over minus 14 right so that gives us slope of half so we have slope of half we can use the point 2 0 to find equation of the line and uh, let's do it in different thing so we need to find y equals to mx plus b and uh, we know m is half right so we can write this as y equals to half x plus b now if i write 2 for x and y for 0 i could solve this as 0 equals to half times 2 plus b right and uh, that gives us b as equals to half times 2 is 1 so b is minus 1 and therefore the equation of the line is y equals to half x minus 1 correct so that becomes the equation of the line so i have squeezed in last few steps at the edge of my video which normally i try to solve in half a page i hope you understand and appreciate what we have done here so we had two parabolas x square minus 4 so let me say sketch it here x square minus 4 the other parabola is opening downwards kind of like this right and these were the points of intersection and if you join them you get a line and the equation of this line is half x minus 1 correct i like you to go through the video once again understand the strategies and how we came across this particular equation of the line and that should help you a lot thanks for watching Feel free to post questions and subscribe to my videos. Thank you and all the best.